Hello and welcome to another episode of Loxone Explained, the video series for all tech enthusiasts, Loxone partners and those looking to become automation installers. This video will be the first of three episodes guiding you through the extensive topic of lighting. In the following video, we will look at lighting design and how to control the lighting. And last but not least, we will dive deep into the configuration using Loxone Config. So, if you're watching this and haven't yet subscribed to our YouTube channel, you might want to do so to make sure you don't miss the following videos. Let's go. The conventional or traditional light bulb, which can simply be switched on and off, is limited when you compare it with how other parts of life have been improved with technology. And lighting is no different. Nowadays, modern lighting can do much more than it could even just a few years ago. Modern lighting technology allows you to adapt any room to be specifically suited to your customer's needs, which can significantly increase their comfort levels. However, intelligent lighting is also an excellent opportunity for you to expand the scope of your business. Are you active in the electrical industry, but not yet a Luxon partner? Then you should check out our program for installers and learn more about becoming a partner. First, let's take a look at the possible light sources and various technologies in detail. It's not necessarily about completely moving away from the familiarity of conventional installations, which, to be fair, have been around for a considerable amount of time, but rather how we can improve a lighting installation with smarter ways to really set the scene in a room. Among the possible lighting fixtures are indirect lighting through LED strips, ambient lighting with the help of recessed spots, but also different types of track systems, LED panels, pendant lights, or in short, any light source that the market has to offer. Much more important, however, is the technology behind it. The most common technologies include mains and an extra low voltage LED technology, bus controlled lights via DALI or DMX, zero to 10 volt electronic ballasts, and also mains light fixtures, which can be controlled through the phase dimming. In principle, Loxone can control almost all types of lights. Nowadays, it's very important to customers that they can adjust the brightness of their lights. However, an increasing number of people also want control over the temperature and color of their lights. After all, this is the only way a lighting scene can be set in an appealing manner. But which technology is the best, most sustainable and most cost-effective way of control? Well, LED technology is leading the way when it comes to modern lighting. To dim energy-saving LEDs, pulse width modulation of 24 volt LEDs has proven very effective. This is because PWM technology allows 24 volt light fixtures to be dimmed precisely and cost effectively. However, you must be careful when using classic mains dimming methods with LED lights. This is because mains LED light fixtures often behave differently in terms of their dimming curve and the minimum dimming level achievable without flickering. You may also find differences within the same LED lights, depending on the production batch, due to the individual electronics of the light. Therefore, it is advisable to use branded products that guarantee consistent quality and availability over an extended period of time. If possible, you should try to test the performance of an LED bulb before purchasing a larger quantity. It is essential to us that we develop products for our partners that are easy to plan and straightforward to install and commission. This is why we offer a range of specially developed lighting products equipped with this 24 volt PWM technology. These are our 24 volt RGBW dimmers, which you can use to control LED strips, or our variety of LED recessed and surface mounted spots for area wide ambient lighting. The ceiling light, an all in one RGBW ceiling light, which also includes a motion sensor, and the pendulum slim, an elegant pendant light for just the right amount of focused lighting. Although, of course, almost any other lights from third party manufacturers can also be integrated. To help achieve this, we have a wide variety of extensions and interfaces in our product range. For example, the DALI and DMX extensions for bus controlled electronic ballasts and lamps, analog 0 to 10 volt outputs, the dimmer extension, 24 volt RGBW dimmers in various designs, as well as relays. However, bear in mind that with relays, customers' comfort levels will be affected because the lights only have on and off functionality. And also, extreme caution is required when switching LED lamps via a relay. This is because inrush currents of LEDs can exceed the actual rated current up to 100 volt which can lead to an overload of the relay. As already mentioned, a quick, easy and sustainable installation for you as a partner is crucial to us. That's why all our lighting products are not only equipped with PWM technology, but can also be easily integrated and configured via the Loxone Tree technology. If you'd like to know how Loxone Tree lighting products are integrated using Loxone Config, then make sure you don't miss the other videos in this series. Now I've got a question for you. 
Which lighting technology do you prefer using? Please share your experiences with us in the comments below. This episode was an overview of all the products and technologies related to lighting. In the next episode, we'll dive deep into the operation and control of light sources. Just to give you a quick preview, we will look at lighting automation, how to control the lights and much more. Because what's the point of the best lighting technology if it's not easy to operate? So stay tuned and I'll see you in the next episode.